uh, my, my surface level thoughts on people with disabilities in the workplace is um, similar to the way I look at general diversity when, you know, I know there's a push now for more gender equality, um, bringing people from different racial backgrounds into, into the workforce as well. Um, and the way I see it is why shouldn't disability be any different? Diversity is all in all good for, for companies, it's good for work culture. And the way I would think about that is to focus on the human, because I, earlier I mentioned that I think when you focus on the human, people reciprocate and they do their best work and, and it's just a win-win for everybody. So I know last time, I, and I'd love to hear your thoughts as well, because you, you are more well-versed in this than I am. Um, you said something interesting last time, Kevin, about uh, making the job description more fit around the person rather than shoving the person into the job description. So, I mean, I'd love for you to, to elaborate because I think you had good insight. Yeah, no, the point of the statement was if you want a productive uh, situation for both uh, a side of the equation, it's always important to accentuate uh, skills and abilities and strengths of people. I think for people uh, with disabilities, a lot of people don't know, like when we talk about accommodations, they can be as simple as the raised height of a desk, the use of assisted software or headphones or headsets. Um, so it's really a matter of education and also uh, the diversification in ideas in thinking. I think that's the key uh, to accepting people with disabilities in the workforce and creating a more inclusive culture. Cool. Um, yeah, so I mean, it sounds like, if I understand you right, it's not as difficult as some people might think to be accommodating, but the education is, is lacking on that. Well, the education's the biggest part and uh, what, what employers uh, uh, would benefit from is understanding that uh, people with disabilities also help them uh, reduce uh, their training costs, increase their productivity, and they show up for work so you don't have to um, continue only train them, right? So it's always important. Yeah.